Twins hosted the Mariners, and the Mariners are plus 110 on the money line. The Twins are minus 130. The over under eight and a half runs. The Mariners getting a run and a half on the run line are minus 190, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you'd win. They lose by one, you win. And the Twins laying a run and a half on the run line are plus 158, meaning if you bet them that way, they'd have to win this game by two. Miller did not pitch against the Twins either last year or this year. Seattle is 5-5 five and five as a team in his last 10 appearances. He's averaging five innings pitched and 4.3 strikeouts per game in those games. And for Ryan, he's pitched against the Mariners twice this year. Four innings, two runs, two earned. They lost that game two to one. He struck out four. Four and two thirds, four runs, four earned. They lost that game five to nothing. That was in Seattle, and he struck out three. The Twins have won his last two appearances. They are five and five in his last ten. He's averaging five and two thirds innings pitched and 7.1 strikeouts per game in those games. So a guy you definitely want to keep an eye out for on the K line, or will there be a strikeout in this inning? Head to head, the home team is five and five. The Twins are six and four against the Mariners in their last ten. The favorite is six and four on the money line, while the underdog, getting a run and a half on the run line, is seven and three. There have been three one-run games in their last ten meetings. One in their last four. The under is six and four in their last ten, and the under eight is also six and four in their last ten. The game they played today, Seattle came back and won 9-7. The game before that, the Twins won 4-3. The game before that, Seattle won 5-0. The two previous games to that, the Twins won 6-3 and 10-3. The Mariners are 5-5 in their last 10. They are 2-2 in their last four games, beating the Blue Jays 9-8. Then losing back-to-back games to the Blue Jays and Twins 4-3. And then beating the Twins today 9-7. For the Twins, they are 7-3 in their last 10. This was their first loss in their last five games. They are 4-1 and one in their last five. They beat the White Sox 3-2, beat the White Sox 5-4, beat the Mariners 4-3, and then lost to the Mariners 9-7. And this was one of those games where I hedged because of how closely the uh, Twins have been playing some of these games. I'm going to take a shot here with Miller. Being that Ryan lost both of his appearances We'll see if this is just one of those teams that he struggles with. So I'm going to take Seattle with the money line. I'm going to take Seattle getting the runs, and I'm going to go under. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut, and please bet responsibly.